job, man. Look at that. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Stevie. Nico. Oh, Nico. What's going on, man? What you up? look nice. Always yeah. look nice. What's going on, homie? What up? I'm good. What you got? It's a gift. It's a nice gift, yeah. you know. Let me see. I got a watch. It's ticking, though. Invited all my girls so we can dance off beat and get us a man and we just gonna have a good time. Okay, first of all, I'm singing this off it. <laughs> Want me to shoot, girl? You don't get it. Wait, wait. Show me the mother <laughs> shoot, baby. Hey, 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 Happy birthday. Hi. How are you? You look beautiful. Okay, you look amazing. Oh, 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 are you? Meet me. I had no idea that Mimi knew K Michelle. We was tight back in the days when we both lived in LA. We lost touch, but that's my girl. trying to pass along the good word that Jocelyn taught me yesterday. I mean, I know she's crazy, but you know, I'm not trying to take no chances. Jocelyn is a real chick. She's real. Did you say Jocelyn? Yes, I said Jocelyn. She ride or die for her man. Her man is Stevie J. I'm sorry, no it's not. No it's not. That would be my man. No it's not, that's her man. So I mean, who told y'all that? Stevie J is her man. Her manager. Her manager. That's her man. Them two together, it's like so some he was inseparable too? type of It's like two? some, oh yeah. You gotta explain to me what you talking about. Oh, she said that's my man. My I man. seen it. I, you don't have to tell me, I seen it. I'm confused. Tonight was supposed to be about me and my girlfriends kicking it, but once again, Stevie's got me all did you not know that they were together or they were seeing each other or you just know that was the artist? I know they work together because he's her manager. But the whole intertwine, like, it's me up. Girl, I'm gonna go out of here. You know what? Honey, I am out of here. I just know when they throw drinks, drinks don't have no name on it. And I just got my hair done and I didn't want to be around it. I immediately got out of harm's way. You look amazing tonight. Are you serious? Did you meet? Did you? you, you, you what? Did you meet? You seen what you said I had to show you? No. Should I shoot you? Come on. Mimi started looking at me with those eyes. You can know when 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 you don't up. You know what I mean? You can feel it. I just felt that it was a problem. Cold red. So. The night began to be interesting. You gotta understand. Amen. I done been through so much shit. And my trust factor is real low. So, I know how that studio life is. Late nights, liquor, and this, that, and third. I already know what the is. Okay, but do you not trust him? You don't trust him? Is that a trick question? I mean, Mimi, you ain't gotta get out of line. The thing is, the man gonna be a man, and you gonna have to just get that through your head. That don't mean I'm him, but I'm gonna work with him. Where does Stevie find these trash bags? Seriously, she looks like a clown. And I ain't gonna stop working with him. Do you catch her? You can't really blame me for nothing. 
till you see us kissing, till you see us sexing, don't come at me with that. I can help that I'm beautiful and I can't help that he's beautiful. And yeah, when we step in the building, we, we, we look real good together. But Stevie and I have great chemistry, so I can't help that. I'm so worried about you right now. Cool. Look at me, look at me. Do I have to make a choice? I would never put you in that position. Never. If you weren't why you call him daddy? Why you telling him that you're gonna take care of him when he gets home? Daddy. Can we ask Carly how she got the fact that they were together? They ask you questions that's gonna f you up at the end. And they gonna be chilling, but you gonna be looking stupid. You got to be smarter than that. I'm leaving. You asked me a question, have you seen them together kissing face or whatever? I'm gonna keep it real, yes I have. We kissed? We kissed? We kissed? We kissed in the lip? Wow. I don't think Carly should have came at Mimi like that without without the full scope of everything. It's just like, it's messy. Carly is a rat. You looking like you're ready to kill me. You're yeah, not listening right. to me. Just give me two, just give me two. I'm gonna knock your head off your shoulders right now. I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. We're not gonna be violent. She saw y'all kissing. I didn't kiss her. What did you do? I didn't kiss her. You getting a kick out of this, ain't you? No, I'm tripping. She getting the kick out of she it. She getting the kick out of it. What happened? She saw them kissing. Yep, last night. I, I don't. Oh, said. yeah, let's go. Hold on. Please, Stevie, let I'm me go. go. I'm out. Come on. Come on, Mimi. No. I'm going home. I mean, let me just talk to you. She got to go for a second. I'm going. Let me holler at you for a minute. Mimi, get up. Come yo. on. Yo. Give me this person. Let's go. Mimi is definitely an enabler when it comes to situations like that. She should have punched him in his face. I would have. I want to see her do better. Mimi. You better, you better act like you know. Act like I know what? Act like you know. Act like I know what? I got a call from Arian inviting me over to have drinks with her and Mimi. The three of us didn't get the chance to hang at my showcase because Mimi's man decides to act a fool. Hi, hi, hi. Hey. <laughs> So, I'm looking forward to a little girl talk today. So what's been going on? Like, I thought we was gonna be partying, excited, y'all saying, what's, what's up? D what, did I do something? Like, what y'all, what's going on? No, you didn't do anything. Mimi. Um, <clears throat> Jocelyn called me the other day, or yesterday. I go meet her, and um, she proceeds to tell me that she's pregnant. Oh. And she tells me she's pregnant by Stevie and just starts going in on me. Like, and I'm sitting at the table confused. But what the f are you mad about? Bitch, you pregnant by my dude. So I told her, call him, have him come down. Oh my God, Mimi. He comes down. He stands in between the two of us and wants to know what we're here for. And she says, I told her, what's up? This fool pulls her pregnancy test out of his pocket. In front of you. In front of me. Why are you carrying this bitch's pregnancy test? For what? Oh, that is nasty. It. That is piss That's off That's carrying around a bloody tampon. I can't. I don't, I don't see how At that you... point, I had nothing else to say. I said, bitch, you and that baby and him, good luck. I, I just left. Well. I, I couldn't take another second of sitting there listening to the When you've had enough of a situation, you've had enough, and only me, knows when I've had enough. I'm bubbled up to the top. He'll say one thing to me, you know, I love you, I wanna be with you, and I want my family, but then he'll turn around and his actions will do something completely opposite. I'm not around Stevie all the time, I don't know what the f he does when I'm not with him, but all I get from him is I love you, I want you, I want my family. But then when, when this type of goes down and I got the next bitch talking about she's pregnant and it's just... If you want to hurt, you can hurt with me, honey. You can hurt, call me, do whatever, because I've been there and I still have hurt days. You got a hold of being strong and my heart goes out to you because I'm a single mama just like you. My baby's father was a clown. 
I just feel like you didn't, she never wanted to say, I'm a single mother, and I she did. always wanted it. And I get it. I like, I get the whole not wanting to be a single mother, but you can't keep fighting for somebody that won't fight for themselves yeah. or that won't. He does not care. For years, I've been telling Mimi she deserves so much better. She keeps saying she's gonna move on and she's gonna do better, and I really pray that she'll just move on. It's time. So what are you doing? I'm all about moving forward. I don't want to wallow in no shit. That's not what I'm about. I don't want no revenge. I'm not no woman scorned. I'm none of that. I want to better myself and I want to move forward for me and my daughter, period. I don't want to do this anymore. I just, I don't. I don't. I'm done. What are you doing? I am cleaning house. I would love to fix my relationship. Who wouldn't? He's the father of my child. Like, I would love it to work. If it's gonna work, if it's not gonna work, then f it. I don't know this, this see you. I just, there's only so much I can take and I can't handle my family and someone else. I can't do that. I mean, he's texts me and he's apologized and he says he wants to make this work. But the bottom line is, as long as he keeps with Jocelyn, I'm not with him, period. Are you happy right now? Like, are you? No, I'm not happy. I'd be sitting here lying if I told you I don't love him and all this, and I'd be lying to you. I love him. I would like it to work, but under the correct circumstances. We all know how charismatic he is, and we know that Stevie is very manipulative. Like, he has held on to you for this long. What the f I can't do this anymore. I've seen this happen so many times. It's all going well. Then Stevie gets bored all of a sudden and just does hurtful to Mimi. But Mimi's to blame too. She's always there to just take him back and welcome him back home with open arms as if nothing ever happened. I just know you. You know what? I know you're what asking you for a victim to the manipulation. You have no faith in me. I do have that faith in you. I do. No, you don't. Mimi, I have faith in you. Well, then stop saying that Okay, shit. well, bitch, I got faith. I just want you to really do it. I got to start somewhere. Hello. And I'm going to keep it moving. I just really want you to get the out of here. Like, are you really going to get Baby, all this out of you here? You see like, what I'm doing, right? You see what I'm doing. Hello. When I told Arian I was at another therapy session with Stevie and Jocelyn, she had a real hard time believing it. Aren't you sick of this though? Fixing it. Fix what? Who said I was trying to fix anything? The reason for that session was for me to feel comfortable with we'll him work working with her. Okay. Well, clearly, that's never gonna happen. Wait, the killer. He came in there with a I Am God t-shirt on. He really has an issue. This dude has lost his mind. At one point during the counseling session when he was talking about both of us was riding his bus, he seems to think that old girl and I are riding off his coattails and his celebrity. Like, you know, he keeps throwing What's it in my though? face. What you celebrity? Know, I'm just telling you what he's saying. You know, don't forget who put you on and this, that, and the third. And I'm like, really? I was made before I met you. Let's not play those Bitch. games. I'm looking at myself crazy. What's wrong with me? That I'm allowing this man to do this to me and, and tell me, you know, I did this and that for you. A, 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 a real man who loved his woman would never do that, ever. That's how I know that it ain't nothing what I thought. It was all smoke and mirrors. When you're being lied to and you're in this pigeonhole of a bubble of what you thought was your life, when that bubble is bust and you can see things clearly, it makes all the difference. What's your plan, though? I'm not sitting around waiting on him. Please I've got don't. my clients. I've got, you know, contracts. I'm doing I'm the things so and happy. taking the steps to have my situation. About time. 
What people don't know about me is I have a cleaning service and I've had it for 11 years. It's called Keep It Clean. I work for celebrity clients. I do residential and commercial property. This is what I do. I don't need Stevie's money, never have, and I never will. He felt like the baby was gonna stop everything. Like once you had the baby, you weren't gonna do else. But, oh, I'ma stick to Eva and Stevie. Eva, Stevie, Eva, Stevie. Really? Absolutely. And you would be a fool to not think the same thing. Well, guess what? I'm back, okay? How about that? Bitch, I'm, I'm back. back. I am absolutely digging Mimi's new attitude. It's about time that Mimi woke up and smelled the coffee. High five and smoke mirrors. High five. Whoa. decided to go public with her new man, so she invited all of us out for a few drinks. I didn't want to steal the spotlight, but sooner or later, the girls would have noticed something different, so I just decided to come out with it. A lot has been going on. Good, like, bad, ugly, what? Look at that face. I know, share, bitch. Y'all see this hand? Wait, what? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I didn't even notice I that. Didn't even I notice need my drink. Wait. I need a drink. <laughs> It's the left hand. Okay. Erica, I'm kind of retarded. I'm looking like, I saw this, but that's the wrong uh, hand. Yeah. Yeah. We're not together no more. Oh, honey, went through his phone, seen letters and junk. And letters? I don't do no phones and Girl. Oh, well, I did. I feel like I have every right to. If I'm supposed to be building this trust in you, what's with all these different females all the time? Since this engagement. Since the engagement. No, that's not cool. Why am I wearing this ring? <laughs> You're not committed to just me here. You committed no, to every goddamn body. I was really looking forward to the girls meeting Nico, but now it's kind of, you know, bittersweet that I'm hearing that Erica and Scrappy broke up. Just a few weeks ago, we were all together and we were at her engagement party, and now she's like, oh, we're done. I'm... Oh, there's the man of the hour. Really? Nico. Get a good look, face me. You want me to take my shirt off too? Nah. Oh my god. Oh, no. <laughs> you, know, you can have a seat. Thank you, baby. I just wanted to make sure I approve. My thing is, it's crazy because I told Mimi the other night, like, I feel like she has a type. I don't. Look, what's the type you think she you has? You know, the muscles, the Tattoo. bill, the, like, the washboard abs. Okay, but, no, no, what ladies, is? let's not get it twisted. I like a certain type of swag. So, look, why are you trying to act like you don't have a certain type? Whatever he, Stevie had is not the same. He has. Please believe That's, it. I don't get that. That's not the vibe I'm getting. I actually like Nico. He was cool. So far, so good, you know? I really love her. I just want to make sure that this not no Stevie repeat or nothing nah. because she's happy. Good. She is yeah. glowing. And that's amazing. I want to make a toast to Mimi's happiness. But also, I want, happiness. I want to let you guys in on something, all right? You're not going to ask her to marry you. No, 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 no listen, that's... Oh, I'm nah, 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 that's not the play. I'm shooting a video, right, that I'm putting Mimi in. And I want you guys to, you attend. know, come out and attend, show us some support, but it's going to be really dope. Okay. Look at this smile. Lynn, honey. I'm making you the star in the video. Thank you, baby. Nico! Keeper! Like, Nico, like, like, like. Hi! Oh. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> What are you talking about? All right, Al. Hi. Yeah. What's up, yeah. Johnny? You good? I'm swell. Uh, I heard y'all chit chatting in here, so I want to make sure everybody's Yeah, we right. chit chat. That's what we do. You all right, babe? We chit chat. We going to change, though. We got to change into another outfit. Well, what you changing into, Nico? What are you about to wear? Oh, you're going to see it. Just be, just be. Surprise, make surprise. Make sure, yeah, make sure you okay. be you watching. You in it too, Johnny? Yeah. Absolutely. What you going to wear? A speedo? Nah, maybe a towel. So we're going to go change into this Please. next outfit. Let's See go. you in a minute. Bye. Go get changed. The towel. Boy, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Who would have thought that Johnny himself would be listening at the door? I mean, what kind of man you know eavesdrop peeping around the corner? I mean, not where I'm from. But I'm here to support Mimi. I just hope she don't look like no $2 hoe on an iPhone 5 video shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. 
things. What's okay, that all focus, about? focus, my darling. I'm focused. Just well, get your let me just, on. Let me just put this out there. I'm just okay. going to say this. Can Whatever's being said I don't about care me, what's being said. Well, I care because my name is in it. I'm hearing gay talk. I have flashbacks when this talk, talk to me. Is, you no, look absolutely beautiful. That's not what it is. Got it. If there's some chitter chat, Mimi, that your friend, K. Michelle, is talking to you about, then you can... Maybe you could let me know. You could relay it to me what yeah, she said to you. We don't, we don't play that over here. This is yeah. a, this is a Okay, you guys do your video. I'm well, saying I'm very, very supportive. You're That's fine. I have my belief. Don't attack her though. We like can yeah, talk she's got No, I'm not attacking her. I'm Nico. You know Nico, I don't really want to hear Mimi. I'm going to go ahead. I want them to have a great video. We don't even want you to watch the video. I want them to have a great video. We want you to leave. How about that? Don't be bad because your co-pilot is gay. No, I just want you to leave though. Out of here. You want to go, Ari? You going to walk Listen, me out? Walk out and leave. Okay, don't come back. Okay, okay. Don't throw your little PMS right, in your chocolate. Come on. Memphis, okay, if I run you out of town. You. Got it. Now, K. Michelle is running around calling Nico gay, which clearly he's not. I don't have time for all this nonsense. The director is motioning for me to go outside. I have to work. Like, this is bull right now. Don't let me end your career. What I are you going to career. do? You want to be on my side. Move away from your roommate. You have Stop a roommate it. in Atlanta. Rent isn't that high before in Atlanta. This is not New York. Yeah, we got a group. thousand dollar rent and you split it. Mr. Nico and Johnny for out of here. I got five That's the real truth five about different, it. in five different states. That's your girlfriend. Leave, not needed. That's your girlfriend. Not That's needed. That's your girlfriend. You can't get a man because of that. You're not needed. Don't you come in here and do nothing. They shouldn't have been attacking this one girl. All of that riffraff about ending her career is so juvenile. Nobody was thinking about anybody but themselves in that moment. Leave her out there, we about to film. Okay, why y'all confront her though like that? If you were shooting a video and okay, we brought that fine. negative energy and to fine. your video. And y'all could have done it another wow. time. No, you're focused on, on this Look, I'm saying. If I hear my name out in the air and I hear somebody All slandering right. my name, okay. I'm gonna address it. Okay, address that at another time. Nah, You're here nah, for this. Yo, y'all can step outside with that. Y'all can't attack this girl We like ain't that. attacking her. I was very respectful to her. Her ass got a mind of its own. What? All I hear every time the door opens is yelling and screaming. I don't know what's going on. We ain't attacking her. Nico! Where's Mimi at? Bring her in here. Nico, I you know y'all attacked her. I didn't attack her. When they said cut, I run back inside and I see Kay all the way out the front door. But I see Aaron and Nico going at it. I had to shut it down at that point. Anybody that's wow. got some beef right now, please get the out of here. Every time I have a scene that's gotta be ruined by some bullshit. Who are you talking to? I'm just I'm talking. Don't be fucking yelling at me. I'm yell at the mother I'm You need to yell at Mimi. Don't do it. I'm, I'm yelling here to defend this and don't you do I'm it. not yelling at you. Yeah. I'm yelling okay. at you. Yeah. Yeah. Every time I'm here, and I'm I'm do something. And ain't me. I'm not, I'm not the one that's doing nothing wrong right that. now. And I knew in that moment she was upset, but take it out on who it needs to be taken out on. For her to yell and say all those things and all that shit, I was just like, oh no, wait a minute, bitch. Let's go, let's go. Relax. We're getting this money. I'm relax. just sick of every time I do something, Yo, it's gotta be relax, about relax, the relax, 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 relax. We got, we got, Yo, we got to work to relax. We got, we moving. Tonight, I'm performing at BB King's in New York City. The line is down the street, but the show is already sold out. I'm gonna turn up, have a good time. No drama, no stress, just me and that microphone. They say I drink too much, curse too much. I could be a little rough, but I got a trust. Give a crit so quick to judge. Loving on my band, don't be showing me love. I got my foot in the door for that every day. So come on, yo. Just make me think it feels some type of way. All I can say is go on, learn to play. Drop it down, old man. This is the most amazing, most amazing feeling. Kay did amazing tonight. I thought she did an excellent job. The crowd loved her. I was proud of her. But what I really wanted to see was her and Mimi mend their relationship. If not for them, just please for me. Hey. Thank you. <gasps> Let me talk to them for okay. one minute. All right. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. They're so pretty. I love them. Nice. You look beautiful. What's hey. going on? I brought Mimi with me, but I just came to support. So, Thank you. I appreciate it. I know y'all both wanted to say some things, I know. So, 
Because I was a little confused about the whole thing that happened the other day at the video shoot. Um, Tell me what your issue was, Kay. Like you told me. Whatever, you just should have my back. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't in the You room. were there when it first started. No, you were standing not. right there. No, you were getting not. your coat fluffed Kay, so you could. It's cool. I didn't see anyone walk up to you. Okay. I didn't even hear the conversation that occurred. We were having girl talk in a room like we always do. Right. He happened to hear, and you know what I said Wait. to him? Not now. It's not the place. It's not the time. But. And that's what I said. If you open that door and question a man's sexuality. He is gay then you need to be prepared for what comes after the fact. Okay, but I didn't want to do it. I didn't want to do it at your event. But you did I, do it at my event. I talked to so you, you and her. You we was on it, whatever. You wanted to question a man's well, you know sexuality what? You know at what, your maybe? event? You know what? All I have to say is that there's no reason that a grown man has a roommate at the age of your boyfriend. He's not a it's roommate. No, they have a roommate. It's I've been over roommate. there. They have a roommate. You've been over where? Me, me. You haven't been anywhere with oh. me. Mimi. Let's be clear it's on that. It's not worth it. Your boyfriend's gay, his Let's friend's be clear gay, on that. and you deserve you better. You can run but your mouth what you all want, you want to do. That's what you, you want, you don't even have a man. You're absolutely so right. Clear. I don't want one like yours. That's what I'm and saying. And you will never have one. Straight or period. Because you a whack ass bitch. Hey. And that's what you resort to. You lame ass bitch. You can't even talk. You got to hit somebody with some Because hey. you a whack Bitch. Exactly. My point exactly. Uh -huh. You immature. Bye bye. Bye bye. Excuse me. That's your friend. Yeah. What's up, man? <laughs> what up? Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Stevie. Nico. Oh, Nico. What's going on, man? What you up? look nice. Always yeah. look nice. Hey, What's going on, homie? What up? I'm good. What you got? It's a gift. It's a nice gift, yeah. you know. Let me see. I got a watch. It's ticking, though. It's ticking? Tick. How that's ticking? A real Roly don't tick tock. You know, only a fake cat to give a fake Roly. But me, I'm official. I'm gonna show you how to do this, son. Is that a gift? Yeah. <laughs> this is something real right here. I wanna see. What's that? Go outside and Is that check a key it out. Is that car, bitch? I gotta Ooh, find you something off of the shrimp for me. This is not real. Listen, we can handle this as men. This is not real. That's how we handle it. We can handle that's, this that's as the as men. Handle, that's, all, that's the only way I'm handling it. That's the only way I'm it. You know who I am, right? It's so, about you. So, listen, what it's about. It's about. Is that, that's this fake, is about. and this is real. <laughs> okay. Well, you wanna go check this car out? Yeah. I do. Let's see what we got you. Hopefully, she got a more than a month, though. Fall back. You sit down. You know what I'm saying? Check this out. Is this the car? Yeah. <laughs> you know? I'm here for it. Oh! Check it out. Come on. Open the door. Open the box. Door, open bitch. the door. It's cold outside. I don't know if I trust Stevie, but it is kind of hard to say no to a new BMW. You give me this, this should be mine with no strings. Yeah, no, no, no strings. It's all yours. No. It's all yours. Come on. He said, there will be no strings attached. But we all know Stevie J and his word ain't so we'll see what happens y'all have a good night look it's for the car yeah. only that's all good not you you know okay. i love you i'm gonna always love you you know what i'm saying yeah i just get that rollie checked out it's like, what? It's like, it's like a bomb the blow the best way to make a woman happy is to give her a luxury car mimi is the happiest when she's focused on the good guy not these wannabe chumps nah what's going on you seen your car? Made me a car. Yeah? So what kind of car is it? BMW. So now that's good. We're gonna put that in the garage and we're gonna add that to the collection. So what else is going on? What do you want him? That's it? Are you serious? I'm asking you. You asking me what? What? Did you move on? Or are you still on the bus? That's my daughter's what? father. Yeah, we know that. We know he's your daughter's father. I'm not grinding that. He should have bought you this car a long time okay, ago. Okay, so what is the argument? The argument is that I feel like you're defending him. Okay. Are we gonna let that ride? Let's, uh, let's, let's just drink to the car that he just gave me. So we should have a good night. We should drink, we should toast, and we should be continue building, right? That's what we're doing? Are we? Nico is really showing his ass right now. The video up. You acting like a bitch now that my baby father gave me a car? I'm going to Europe, I'm going around the world. You ready to go around the globe or you want to stay stuck in the I done been with around the globe. What you want to do? I done been around the 
They Look, stuck in Atlanta with a Let me Stevie. tell you what. Why are you talking about right. Stevie? I'm my own bitch. I have nothing to do with no <laughs> Stevie. Why are you bringing his name up? Take okay. your car keys. Oh, take your five don't tell series. me what to take. Unless you don't tell me what to take. You don't tell me what the Conversation is done, man. Let's toast. So, what the that's what oh, we talk, talk about. about. We talk about this. We'll talk about this later. You're damaged. We're gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about. No, we're not talking about me being damaged. Damn. Nico has lost his mind calling me damaged goods. If I'm so damaged, why you with me? I was trying to show you a large picture. You I don't like it. We gotta go. I sound damaged. Sound like a deranged woman. You all right? Let's go. I sound deranged. You, you deranged and damaged, so bitch. Like, what the I'm damaged. Uh, you really about to piss me the off. No, but she's coming with me. She's not going to lie. She is. She's staying here. Stop You're putting. not staying here I'm to talk about deranged. Y'all gonna talk about damaged. Got you. I got you. Yeah. I'm gonna be a deranged, damaged bitch. Go back to Stevie. Hey, girl. Hey, dog. How are you? I'm wonderful. How are you? Good. Davis. Hello. Mimi calls me and lets me know she's back in town from some trip to LA, whatever. I'm just excited she's back, cause I cannot wait to tell Mimi about what happened at Jocelyn and Stevie's party. So, what's up ladies? You know we went to that party the other night. <laughs> Mimi, I blacked out. <laughs> what you mean you blacked out? I think all like my that? liquor hit me at one time. Mm. Oh, oh, I remember this, <laughs> July 29th. Wait, it, before the July 29th. I was like, oh, so you guys got married? Like, what day did you get married? You know, was it family there? Um, the end of July. I said, wait, you don't know the date? July 28th, July 29th, yeah, July 29th. I said, do you have a marriage certificate? She was like, of course. Where is it? Because that's public record. They're lying. Anyway, what else? <laughs> Your gift was given to. Oh yeah. She was like, oh, thank you. We got two, we got one more. I was like, oh, okay. She stormed out that party. I remember that. Why'd she do that? Um, I think she, it might have hit her. why she left. When it was she like, oh, this from is from you. Mimi. She was happy before she knew it was from me and she got mad. Yeah, I think that whole pole thing was a very clever idea. So kudos to you. <laughs> yeah. What we really need to address is these naked pictures of Mimi and Nico. Girl, what was you thinking? What's going on with you? I saw the pictures. I was like, whoa! I'm mad because you didn't tell me. Tell you that they what? were out. They were sent to me, not by you. I didn't know they were out. These are my girls. And as much as I want to keep this deal a secret, the whole world is about to know. And I want to be the one to tell them first. We actually had a major billion dollar company contact us. Like, this is the company who put out Kim and Ray J. Pam and Tom Lee. Now Nico and Mimi. I've been telling her from the start that Nico's no good and now has turned Mimi into a porn star. So we actually flew to LA and met with them in person. Oh my God. Yeah. Why? Because they had a copy of the tape. You signed papers and it's gonna be released. It's done. Wow. Your daughter has to see this, Mimi. What about Eva? I can either let this tape run around for free or I can be a businesswoman about this and capitalize off of it and send my mother daughter to college. And guess what? That's what I'm gonna do. Not only is Mimi a mother who's done a sex tape with her boyfriend, but now you consent into the release. Mimi is my girl and all, but I think she may have just made a deal with the devil. You know you're a porn star now. I had sex with my boyfriend and the tape got out. Period. Okay, so the person that stole. I don't know who stole it. Did nobody steal it? Nico is definitely a liar and a manipulator. And now she's seemingly blinded by everything but love. Like, when are you gonna open your eyes, Olu? He ain't it. You really trust him, huh? I did. Trust you did. Him. Yeah, my trust is a little weary right now. I mean, now. I would expect it to be after a situation yeah, like if this. if it weren't, you would be crazy. Telling my girls is something that I had to do, but the worst thing is this getting back to Stevie. So I need them to keep their mouths shut. Please don't say anything about this. I don't need Stevie to find out. You know, he's gonna make my life a living hell as far as Eva's concerned. Okay. And... He's gonna try to take her. He can't take 
because he got his own that he's got going on. And if he thinks that his situation is better than mine, when he lived with a known prostitute. Well, I just know he's about to give you hell. I know this. Okay. So the less people that know about this before the hits the fan, the better. So we need to swear. You're asking us for secrecy and all this Cool. So you have to make a path to stay in touch and let us know. Don't say nothing. Y'all gonna just make my life more f***ed up. Please don't do that. Okay. You my girl. I care, so. All right, and a top. So give me 12 of those. We gonna get all this tight. Okay. I need 12, 12, come on. So after my talk with Mimi about this whole Nico situation, I kind of just wanted to get my own answers from him personally. So I decided to go visit him myself. Hi, Nico. Well, wow. What are you doing? Hello. You go here? No, I don't go here. You're not even a gym at uh, Yeah, but I wanted to kind of talk to you, so. Can I? Yes, no problem. Mimi told me she's been working out with you recently, so. Absolutely. How are you guys? We're excellent. We ain't got no problems. So you know you feel OK, so what's she tell <sighs> And I'm listening. Why do you feel like my friend is so uncomfortable with things with you and her right now? Maybe because what's about to explode the on tape. the scene, the tape. Can I ask you something? Actually. I'm sorry, it's been bothering me. Go ahead. This tape, how did it get into the hands of an adult entertainment company? I have no idea. I honestly feel like you had something to do with it. Am I wrong? No, you're not wrong for thinking anything. Okay. You're entitled so did to you your have opinion. something to do with it? Absolutely not. Nico is looking me dead in my eye, telling me a bold-faced lie about this tape being leaked. I feel like nobody just goes on vacation and the camera's in their bag and then all of a sudden the tape is gone. Yeah. Really? Yeah. How ironic. And you're smiling about it. I'm just listening. Like you weren't in an oh moment when it happened? Absolutely. We went through those emotions. That's over with. It's yes. not over with. This yes. is what I'm saying to you. It's not over because it's still lingering with her. She's is it? Yes. Okay. Personally, Arian, she's beneath me. I don't have to answer none of her questions. If Arian is really Mimi's friend, then she should know how important I am in her life. Clearly, she doesn't trust you. I have, yes, I can't help her with her trust issues. All I can do is yes, comfort her. Yes, you can. Her. You're listen, not comforting her well enough. Listen You're listen great, and she's going through something. Where's, where's the balance? Well, just keep watching, bro. Just no, keep watching. That's what you do. Keep that's watching. That's your friend. Blood. I want you you to sound keep crazy. Paying, paying attention to our relationship like you're doing right no, now. No, that's not what you want me to pay attention to. You want to pay attention to the sex teeth. Are you serious? Yes. Well, watch that too, though, yeah. Mm, but thanks. we're not talking about the sex no, right now. We're talking I'm good. About, I feel like you're a fake friend. I'm a fake friend, how? Absolutely. Explain yourself. I feel like you don't have Because I'm a, not around? You don't have an interest. Because I'm not around, yes, so I'm a fake friend? I feel like you want to capitalize on everything she, she's doing. Are you kidding me? I do my own You want to move into the you're house? You're the one. Really? Wanna... I want to move into the house? I'm good. My friend comes yes. and stay with me. She want... can't deal yes. with y'all. I, Why are you asking you me don't. these questions? That shit is coming out. It's about to hit her hard. You don't care. I don't? I'm in it with her. What do you mean I don't care? I'm out. Are you serious? Bye, Nico. Bye-bye. When you want to talk again, just nope. pick up the phone. I'm good. All right, call me. I knew I couldn't watch this by myself. I waited. I can't believe it's actually out. Like, it's it's like it's for real. So Mimi's sex tape came out today, and I decided to go to Erica so we can watch it together. It's going to be really hard to watch this, but my friend is making national news. I really need to see how far Mimi's willing to go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I can't. Did you see this? This is not something they made. This is some professional, like, and this, this is in different areas. What the? This ain't no homemade Arian, I this your friend, like you, who you like this with. I am disgusted, 
It ain't even for Mimi, cause you a grown ass woman. You had a choice, it's for Eva, cause she didn't have one. Now this pisses me off. That's some up selfie right there, I'm telling you. Yeah. I don't care how I'm much sorry. money you get for this. You got a child, and that's because I got any money. It like this hurt my heart. I got a child, and like, it's a little girl that gotta deal with this. A little girl. This her mama. I don't like don't like cry. this. No, I don't. Don't cry. I don't. You better talk to her before I do, because I'm hurt of feelings. That's up. You couldn't give me a million dollars to put some out like that. I don't care. Where's your integrity? Where are your morals? Where are your values as a woman and as a mother? Where? Where are they? So we were invited here. Yes. Have you talked to her? Well, I did talk to her, but not about. So y'all okay. never discussed anything? Talk about her dad. He had to get his leg amputated. Oh, no. So you didn't hear about the stroke? No. Her dad had a stroke. I, I haven't talked to Mimi since we were at the spa. I just know she's going to get overly defensive and come in here with this attitude. But I'm not here for all that. Like, I just, I really want you to, I want to let you know how I feel as your friend. Like, this ain't no fly Hi, by, no way kind of thing. What's up? Hi. Hey. I just left my dad in New York. He's doing better, thank God. But now I have some things I need to handle in my own life. I've been hearing that my girls feel some type of way about my sex tape, so I invited them all out to set the record straight and be done with this once and for all. I talked to Erica. I know how Erica feels, so I called y'all here to put this on the table right now and well, talk about it. When I initially saw it, I was like, this is not a sex tape. Because when I looked at it, I was like, this bitch look like a movie. But you saying it's something else, hey, we would hope that it is what you're saying it is. So you know I lied to you? I did. Wow. It looked pretty movie-like. They cut it and slowed it down and speeded it up and added music. Yeah, once you put all that it's gonna look real fancy. Let me ask you this. When you guys were sitting down and talking, what was Nico's whole swag like? He is about his money, period. I, I, I'm not trying to, I want to question, like, I can't even eat. Nico, as a man, I know, I was about to say the same thing. Like, as a man, like, I don't want the world seeing my lady, so I'm going to try to do what I need to do to stop this. For her daughter. That too. For her daughter first. The bottom line is, am I going to cry about what I could have done, or am I going to think about what is going on right now today and what I got to do from right now moving forward? Nobody's here to jump on you, Mimi. No, like, no, no, no. I just, you're just so like this. If you're my friend, I need you to be my friend. This is what you don't get. I understand this. Do you? Because I've never judged you for Am I judging you right now? Am I judging you right now? Yeah, don't get loud, y'all. Am I judging times. you right now? Is this it me judging? I just said. Times. Oh, you were porn star. I said that to you jokingly. jokingly. It That's was. a joke. Mimi, it was a joke because I didn't joke. think it was an actual porn. I made a decision, and I'm going to live by my decision, no matter how you feel about it, you or you. Why are you crying, Arian? Mimi, we have gone through so much. It just sucks to hear you say, oh, well, I don't need to be judged by you, and you don't do this. Like, what? But you judge me you in my know. relationships. Yes, you do. I'm not judging you in your but relationship. You do. I ask you personal things because, Mimi, it bothers me that you keep choosing the same kind of guy. Let me tell you the difference between me and you. I will keep my opinion to myself if I don't like whoever it is that you I have an opinion about something. You got something to say about him. I don't oh, like it. I don't like him. So what? I know you don't. Well, look, I, you, don't, you don't like him? It's been declared. What's done is done. You got to handle the situation the best way you know how at this point. I did something that I can't take back. And I got to right. live with that. And guess what? I'm OK with that. If you can live with it, all the, the three of us damn sure won't live with it, and that's just what it and is. And that's my thing. Everybody's like, are you OK? Like, I'm in a corner about to slip my wrist. No, I've been through worse than this. Arian needs to dry her tears and move on with her life. I can't spend any more time comforting her through this mess. It's my problem, not hers. What do you want me to do? Stop fighting me. I'm not fighting. We're we going to go to sleep on this. 
I want to look you eye to eye and I want to know everything that you told all of us about the tape as far as it getting leaked and that's the reason for putting it out there, that is the God honest truth. Yes. Why would I lie about this That's all I need to know. As long as I don't hear that Mimi was involved in some slick about putting this tape out for some money, I'm cool. Obviously, Mimi is adamant about her position, so I have to trust her. Everybody, everybody's gonna have their opinion about this Oh, it looks like this and it looks like that. And I know what the it is. So, I don't know what else to say. I feel like I don't know who Mimi is anymore. I feel like she's lost herself and she's acting irrationally towards the people that really care and love her. I just want to know that I can trust what you're saying is true. That's all. I just hope that you did not lie about it. It's been declared. I just it. leave it alone. Hi, Hi, Boo. Hi, Boos. Hey, how are you? I am dealing. There's no point in me trying to keep Nico's marriage a secret. It's all over the internet. So I'm gonna tell Arian and Erica everything before they get a chance to ask me. This is gonna be hard for me because these two have hated Nico since the beginning. Okay, first things first. I don't want any I told you so's. I can't make promises like that, but go ahead. Arian, you can okay. just say you'll try. I'm trying. Okay, I'm gonna just give it to you. Sorry. Okay. So my boyfriend, Married. No. How long? Since 07. He's the greatest manipulator walking. I picked up on his bull the moment I first met him. All he's continuously done is proven himself to be the scumbag parasite that I've always thought he was. He says that he's with me and he wasn't gonna say anything because he was gonna get a divorce. Can you believe that? I'm telling you what came out of his mouth. Okay. When did you find out? How? It was on social media. When you found out via social media? I confronted him. He was very nonchalant about it. Like really? it was nothing? Like, yeah. Okay, I'm married basically, so what? Get over it, like what's the big deal? As much as I blame Mimi for the choices she's made in her life, how was she supposed to know that her boyfriend was married? That's just crazy. Mimi has been going through issue on top of issue, and it really seems like Nico was the beginning of her downfall. I mean, so much stuff has been surfaced and leaked, I mean, and it all involves him. What bothers me the most about this is I was defending him. I defended him to you guys over and over and over again. I feel disrespected. I feel played. This tape, purposely done. Do you think he leaked the tape? Like, I don't want to believe that he would do that. What? Girl, believe it, because if he was married and he done strung you along like a little puppy this whole time, he leaked the tape. If Mimi is ever going to understand who she's dealing with, the time is right now. He's married, he leaked the tape, he used you, period. Mimi, what about the production of that tape, though? Because that was just not no tape. It wasn't a homemade tape. The, the initial tape was homemade. The initial tape? The initial tape. Oh, wait, you've had multiple tapes. Yes. Oh! Boom, and there it there is. There we go. For months, Mimi has been down our throats, adamantly saying she had nothing to do with this sex tape. And now there's a new story? The company said, we don't have enough footage because it has to be a certain amount of footage to sell. So you guys went back and did additional footage? Correct. So why we didn't get all this from the beginning? Because I didn't feel like I needed to divulge all that from the beginning. Wow. That's a lie. Mimi has been flat out lying to us since day one. Makes me wonder, what else have you been lying to us about? He and his wife, they're in cahoots behind all of this. They, they I'm might sorry. Be. They I, have, I have to agree with you. They they might be. This was a whole setup. It's this is a whole a setup. A plan. And what eats me up is you could have got any random ass hoe out here. It's so many thirsty hoes, but you got a mother. Which means he never cared about you or Eva. That not helping me. Period. Ain't nobody helping me but me. Okay. Okay. So we ain't gonna continue this. I made the decision I made, and that's what the it is. Period. 
My back was against the wall and I had to make a choice. Got that. Do you? I have that. Let's be clear. It's okay. Because you got me f***ed up right now. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. So stop. Until you were in my shoes, you cannot say f to me. Okay, um, I'm ready to go. Okay, I had enough. <laughs> Arian and Erica know exactly what I've been through these past couple of weeks, and for them to sit here and just judge me some more, it's just too much for me, and I don't have to listen to it. Hi. Mary. Mary. Nice to meet you. Hi. Nice to meet you. Can't say it's so nice, but we leave. Feeling yeah, mutual. I came here to see Jessica Dime walk in Prima Donna's show. I had no idea that Nico would be here with his wife. After two years of keeping her a secret, now he wants to bring her to an event? as his date? This is ridiculous. You're claiming her now. No, no, it's Because for two me. years, he wasn't claiming you. No, we're not doing this. Not, you know. not, don't tell me what I'm going to do. I'm going to tell you what you're going to do. No, you're going to get your finger no, that, out of no, my no, face that's because that's not that real. Not. Get your f***ing hand out of my face. So here's the meme I've been hearing so much about. Already angry and so ready to fight. I guess she forgot that she's the one who cheated with my husband, <laughs> but it's all good. You're so emotional. I'm emotional, sweetie. Because yeah, because you did a you, sex tape with a man no, that's that not you right found I'm out that off was married. You I should do be that because that was your husband. husband. Your friends don't know the truth about but you. you do. That you two planned this. You two planned this together. But you know me. And you're listening to this. So I don't put the battery in your back. No, he didn't put a battery in my back. Put your hand out of my face. Make me. Stop. You're going to get your hand out of my face. Stop. The minute I saw Nico walk in with Margo, I knew that I should have grabbed Mimi and probably exited stage left because I knew that these two women could not coexist in the same building. Did she tell you that I mean, the both of them leaked this tape together? No, no, I'm not here defending no. him. She wants to run away because you're a coward. Be a woman. Own up to it. I, I'm Let's a go. full woman. No, I'm Margo, stop woman. putting your hand in her you face. Are Own up to it. This is all a big mess. Mimi was with a man that she didn't know was married for two years, and Margot found out her husband did a sex tape with another woman. Both of them should really be slapping the out of Nico instead of fighting each other. You with deserve your husband a for hand two years. In your he lied to me and he lied to you. You didn't lie to me. Things is a little uncomfortable right now. I got these two women arguing about me, like I'm not even standing here. But I know better to not get in between their situation. So it's best to let them get it off their chest. Nico does dumb but I know that he's not a slick ass to leak a sex tape he is. without you knowing behind your back. You did it together. That's what he told you? Yeah, you did I it think together. what you're mad about is you're not reaping you the benefits off the sex tape. I think you think a lot of things. Your husband you're a liar. is lying to you. You're this is not being resolved. You dragged his name and made it I look did. like he leaked a tape behind I did your that. back like you didn't know. I did that. Yeah, you want to do I something, do it and own it. But don't do it Margo. and then put the blame on somebody else the because you're too much of a coward. You're a coward. Goodbye, bitch. You're stupid with a dumb ass putting a battery in your back. You got the nerve to call me a coward? It's okay, baby. I screwed your husband for two years, took the sex tape money straight to the bank while you were chained somewhere in Nico's basement. Now you want to pin some shit on me because you're too afraid to believe that your husband is a complete scumbag lowlife that everybody knows he is? Who's the coward now, boo-boo? Arian, is it? Yes. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> this is the first time I'm ever meeting me. He's a clown. He knew she was going to be here. He didn't know. Him and Mimi masterminded this whole thing together. I'm just down he here. He told you this? Nico told me that Mimi's a mom, and he said that he had to take the hit for the both of them. You believe She's a that? mom? Why shouldn't I believe it? You think that he really just leaked a tape behind her back and she had nothing to do with I it? I mean, I don't know. Honestly, I've had my doubts from the beginning. I've asked Mimi a thousand times, and she swears that she just made a tape with her boyfriend that got into the wrong hands. And then she decided to get on board for the money. They did it together. We can agree you don't know your friend. I trust that she's telling me the truth. And I and trust that like... Nico's telling me the truth. It was that she was upset with Stevie J and Jocelyn, and she was jealous. He's and... telling you one thing, she's telling me something. Bottom line is Mimi knows she doesn't have to lie to me. As her friend, I will love her no matter what bad decision she makes. So I gotta believe that she's been telling me the truth, and Nico has been telling his wife what she needs to hear. Will it ever come out? It'll come out if she out. tells the truth. So what if she tells the truth and it's still what she said? I just don't okay. think that you guys know your friend like you think you do. When Arian told me she was working this art show for Margo, I threw her ass out my house. But everything's changed now, and I need to talk to my friend. And I couldn't think of a better place to track her down than at Margo's event. I owe 
with my friend Arian an apology? And I have a couple words for Margo. I'm sick of the tapes, the f***ing audio threats, and all this broker ass f I will expose it myself so I don't have to deal with you or anybody else. I am taking my power back. I love you. <laughs> you see what you are. I guess Phoebe's here to support her friend because she's damn sure not here to support me. Tonight is a big night for me, and I cannot have Mimi turning up the way she did at Prima Donna's fashion show. I'm hoping that she can manage to keep it classy, even though it's probably going to be hard for her. I came to support you. I know the conversation we had at my house. I was feeling some type of way about your ass. I'm like, that, you're my friend, and I'm going to come and support. I appreciate you. I love you. And you know, for real, I really wanted to have a conversation with Margo. I really did. From what happened the last time I was in her presence. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate Thank you. Thank you. What made you come tonight, though? I don't know. I'm in a different headspace. Good. And no confrontation, though. No, 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 no. Okay. I got That's not why I'm here. A new day. Yeah. A new day. OK. Hi. Hi, Margo. I'm surprised to see you here. Come on. I want to talk to you. Let right. me step over here. Arian, I'll update. Okay. Have fun, please. I will. Mimi seems to be in a really good headspace tonight, but I'm going to stay very close by in case I have to interject at any point. So, Marco, woman to woman, I'm gonna tell you how this whole thing got started. Well, I'll humor you, okay. This was Nico's plan from the gate. Even to the point, you should play the victim. Let me be the bad guy, all of it. I'm guilty of helping Nico figure out how to get this tape to the world. And I did that, and I'll take responsibility. I did all of that. Um, did I hear what I think I just heard? Did Ola Ramey Faust just admit to leaking this sex tape? Okay, but Mimi, you said the other day you believed he leaked this behind your back. That's what you said to me. That was a blatant lie. It was. Right. It was. Exactly, so. It was a blatant lie. I've been Mimi's biggest supporter. And now I'm realizing that my best friend has been lying to me for over a year. Are you serious? Obviously, we have a lot to talk about. Honestly, Erin, I'm so confused. You're confused? I don't know why you're confused. Still, let me start putting my hands in your face like I did at no. the other show. You can no. do that, and I will Let's pull go. your respect down again. No, like Let's, go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And you talk about being Let's a go. child. Let's go. How old are That's you? not happening, Marco. I'm younger than you. Happening. You are. <laughs> Let's go, baby. And Let's you go. act like it, too. Yeah. The only reason she's telling the truth after a year and a half of lying to anyone that would listen is because she knows she's busted. Nico has proof, and I'm refusing to keep silent. Now the whole world knows that Mimi Faust is full of Good night. Eat a bitch. Mimi! Bitch. Hold up. Yes, I'm naked, but that's not going to stop me from getting the answers to the questions I've been asking for over a year now. What the was that? Yo, Arian, this is the deal. I'm sick and tired of this ass. Which trying one? Trying to hold something over my Nico. Yes. OK. And no more. You guys did do this together? Yes. Did I do this sex tape with him? Yes, I did. Wow. I covered, and I just lied, and yes, and I deceived my friends. I did all of that. You should have said that a long time ago. I'm sorry. I should have, but I didn't. If you're mad at me, you don't want to with me no more, I get it. But guess what? I can't take this anymore. I'm going to speak my truth. Said it I've been telling her, you all your truth. And I did How long have I been saying that? And I did How long have I been saying that to you? How long have I been you, saying that to you? You can't tell you? me when I can Oh my I didn't truth. say all. So I, I didn't say it tonight. I did it tonight. I'm sorry if you got a problem with that. It's not that I have a problem Clearly with it. Clearly you do. No, I have been. Mimi, do you not know that this has been sitting unsettling with me? Do you know how the f it's been unsettling with me? And, and it didn't have to be. What it was. It did not it have to be. Well, it was. What can I say at this moment? I was stuck. But as my friend, understand what it took for me to speak the truth. The that Arian is complaining about is nothing to what I had to endure by making this decision. Let's be clear. You chose that. I did. You made that decision. I and you did. kept living with it. I did. Unnecessarily. I did. It's stupid. Okay. Well, it was. Stupid. Maybe I was stupid. What the f you want me to say? Nothing. You what the f you want you me to say now? For living you that life for long. You mother right I was.
I was a stupid bitch. Honestly, I don't know what to think anymore. I don't know Mimi anymore. What did you think I was gonna do if you told me the truth? I didn't know what else to do. I love this girl, and to know that she couldn't come to me and tell me the truth really, really hurts my feelings. I have no more energy for this Then go. It's just too much to process right now. Hey, yo, it's Safari, listen. Thanks for watching, and you are now tuned in with the brand new Love & Hip Hop YouTube, all right? Subscribe, click it, there's a button right there. Hit it right there, and subscribe, all right? Cheer!